Fala galera, beleza? Aqui quem fala é Arte, seja bem-vindos a mais um vídeo aqui no canal. E no vídeo de hoje são os melhores momentos dos jogos profissionais de CS. Eu sei que você curte, mas 70% das pessoas que assistem os vídeos aqui no canal todos os dias não são inscritos. É isso mesmo. Então, não se esquece, se inscreve aqui no canal, deixa o like. E lembrando que dá muito trabalho trazer todos os dias os melhores momentos, tudo mastigadinho pra você assistir. É bom, né? Então, deixa de enrolação, vamos ao que interessa, são os melhores momentos. Fui. That is so, also true. It's also all true. The Eve fans are here, but uh, yeah. I'm going to drop the smoke. You're going to break it with an HE grenade. And unfortunately, I hate to break it to you guys. Uh, we've ever been sort of missed the start of the game. Oh. But I think all you've missed is uh, Tabson getting a 3k on a pistol and securing that. And, um, yeah, I think that's going to. Oh, yeah. 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 There we go. Already just making sure they close that one out. Green $3,900. Uh, that's probably half a year at this rate, honestly. That is a huge. <laughs> of course, you want one of those. Go check out CS Money. Safe gonna find the opener. Tabson to fall. The Molotov on the sandbags will force him away from that headshot position for now. Of course, the smoke will be popped in too, but in. They might be arguing behind big very quickly here. I'm probably expecting. Yep, there goes Crimbo. This is one, and I think they know where the final main player on this A bomb site is. Process is stuck. And he'll get destroyed by exit. Of course, Manto, I said final remaining player, but he's still toward gap. And it doesn't seem like they know he's there at the moment. Oh, oh but that's a bad miss. But he's managed to recover, so he's still in with a chance. It would be a one versus four, though. And I think he'll be pinched from both angles. Past his position, and there we go. And Sunny will remove him. And I'm afraid. He and Tabson. On the back of each other with Mantu in support as well with that rifle. I haven't seen a huge amount of the Manto Mantu AWP yet, and that's probably because they don't need it. That is a beautiful pinch from Big, sort of mid round there, minute to go, just when MRBR are trying to take the bottom of ramp. They all pick together, and the angles work out brilliantly to get all three kills. It's lovely. It really is. Teamo is looking so damn good right now. Remaining two from MRBR. They can say in a little bit of trouble. I get some space out and towards the site itself, Sin. Keeping them at bay over towards generator. He's actually do, have to do all too much. He basically just buy time for the rotation to come through. Speaking of, there it is. Mantu gonna find one more, and Sunny will fall. An exit, probably gonna very swiftly exit from this round. And a 1v5, no chance. Oh. And deleted through the smoke, headshot. And 51 as as he goes like, you know, even KD, he's done his job. But one and seven is not a good start. Oh my goodness. <laughs> See you later, say. Good See you next night, round. Night, sunshine. Oh my lord. That's me. I hit my X uh, hotkey keybind. Next round. Next round. Good, good <laughs> night. <laughs> Deleted, dude. It's probably going to be a very similar fate in a second as well. He's just on the corner. I don't expect someone down low, but drop plucks off Tabson. And to the answer back. Brinson going to find one of the owners all towards process. It's actually a little bit more puggier than we would have thought here. And he would have only perhaps risked going down with nothing. So smart play from Sin. Patient again from Big. Mantu positioned toward window. And I think he'll be known. Krimbo will certainly be known. Baranazan. Oh, what a lovely second kill that is on Mantu. Picking up the AWP instead. And he found it, of course. Off his teammate's safe. Here's a steps running up close. Does not need to pull the trigger. That Molotov should have... Essentially cleared this back position. It didn't spread far enough and Crimbo steps up for one. Swing is on another. Can he make it through? The answer's no, but surely done enough. The rotations come through and it's safe in a 1v3. Make that 1v2 Ooh. safe setting up for something. My God, he's close. Boy. But no cigar. Seven to five. Uh, you know, very decent start for being, of course. Four rounds in a row for back that pistol. And that's a bad start. Mantu plucks off drop and he gets another as well. Hey. He's sticking around for seconds. Thirds, maybe. Eyes bigger than his stomach, but it doesn't matter. He's done enough. Yeah, Sin catching safe as well as a big one. Four versus two. And now, it might be I needs to position themselves in some... In what they might consider as unlikely positions to try and get a couple of freebies. And Sunny will spot at least one, because Big has seen that. And he's getting flanked for mid. It's going to be a little bit of a split. 2-2. Two, two, two mid, two ramp. Or two stairs, I should say. And Brunzan, he may have a diffuse kit. Picked up off the ground from one of his teammates. But I don't think he's going to have much say in this one. Actually, it would be probably a nice idea if he was to save that Kevlar and that kit. Hang on a minute. Process, you wow. cheeky devil. How have you got here, mate? 
Gets one, spots one, sandbags, way to the rotation two, process, entry fragging, galore as he makes another, oh my god, one man has won this round. I imagine to catch a rotation as well, even before the sandbags play went down, I believe, so it just shows so you quick. how clean that was. So quick, got onto site, barely just alive. Yeah, that's one of the hardest things to see on CS2, actually, fighting through those Molotovs. But off the back of that, Big are going to burst straight toward B. And Sani, the B defender, will get sprayed by Tabson. And Exit will get tapped by Tabson. And now in a four versus three, MIBR with drop. Nothing to offer up. So, 12th collected. T half. Yet to lose a T round. MIBR, of course, let to win a CT round. And they're just going to try... And do what they know best. Brawl their way into a site. Look where Crimbo is already. Goodness me, it's happened again. Poor old Insani has got no idea what's just hit him. Five versus three. MIBR incredibly stuck. Another spray will come through from Tabson. Drop will drop. I think they're about to drop out of Vertigo as well. Safe is in position. Unfortunately, he gets hit with a re-smoke just as he goes for the duel. He has to swing at least four different angles. And if he's not even allowed to do that, Process will spam him straight through heaven. And Exit is uh, more screwed than a screwed thing. Yeah, there's no chance it. He knows kind of part of your thing. Do I just save my KD a little bit? Not exactly like it's any good, unfortunately. He is uh, 0.38. In a rough game for him. Exit frags. No. Ouch. Flawless for Big to close it out. Go, go, go. CS, go fast. Let's roll. Thank you. Counter-terrorist win. There's always a chance. There is always that chance. I always love to see when a CT side buys a kit on a pistol round as well. I always feel like it's such an important thing to have in every single one. Tabson, already playing very defensive, and now that smoke can go onto the bombs. This is going to be tough for them to fight, but all the kills are coming through. There's no fight back at all. I don't think they're on the bomb. They are not. And yes, there's even knives in the smoke to make doubly sure. All the not kills. as young as Donku, 16, of course, but... It's, uh, yeah, it's definitely a plan for the future. And, of course, we know that by all the conversations we've had about Sin and uh, Sin and Tabson kind of sharing IGL duties and maybe moving over to Sin one day. But, yeah, it looks like we're going to go into a B again. And, oh, Branzan, he'll get caught on the angle immediately. 4v3 again. And look at Krimbo's position. Krimbo. Surely going to line up a couple of scalps here. Just has to make sure that Mantu can get some safety in the palm. That smoke's fading. Mantu falls. Tabson trades, but exit will... Get one back. Still, Crimbo remains unchecked. 2v2. X is a known quantity. Surely got to peek at some point. It's going to get chased on the way out. Crimbo going to make sure he cleans that one up. But now he's after the one versus one. No kit, of course. Can't really play the time. 12 seconds, 11 seconds, 10 seconds. He has to now get out of there, and he knows it. Crimbo has played this to perfection. He even checks him at the end, and that will probably cause him to go down to the bomb. He'll at least take Crimbo with him. Does he survive? No, he doesn't. Maybe, uh, maybe Big maybe bigger see the schedule today and think, okay, let's get this one yeah. done and quickly so we have time to prepare for tonight. Yeah, roar up on the dock. It's not an easy team to play. Oh, oh Broses. Yeah, naughty dog. That's a lovely shot once more, but unfortunately can't drop. As the namesake says, Broses falls. Now he's got himself a potential bit of a one way to oh. get another man to had the right idea, just a little bit slow on the uptake. Yeah, dropped, putting in some numbers. That's exactly what we need to see from him. Two big kills to respond in this round. A breakage of the smoke by Tabson. Brunzan looking to hold the line, and Tabson may have taken drop, but actually, they get a two for one from it. So, probably not something they should have gotten there from the position of Brunzan, but the A1S couldn't complete the kills, and now Exit and Insani in a difficult situation. Sin and Krimbo can once again work together, and possibly ward off in this two versus two. Big duel one by Insani, though, and of course, even though that Sin knows where both those players are coming from, there's just too much to deal with for him. So MIBR will get around on the board on CT. Of course, That's CT and Ibis is... <laughs> Sorry, I had to get that one in. I've been sitting on it for two rounds. Oh, Crimbo nice catches shot. Insani. Actually, a decent lurk from Insani. But uh, unfortunately, I don't think he was expecting Crimbo to be throwing all that spawn utility. Does catch him. Drop going to be tested here. Oh. It's opportunity for one, but lined up one through the smoke. Quickly traded by Tabson, however. Yeah, it's a, a good one to take. At least he gets his one for one, but again, that obviously 
That smoke being up in such a weird position it forces Bionis in a way, but hang on, okay. Protus is not holding that line in toward Cave, and in the end he has to swing wide to deal with Safe. Bonplant denied by Safe. But thankfully for Big, it's not like the clock was a problem. You can pick it up and get it planted again, all good. Of course, MRBR may have defuse kits, but Bernazan needs a, a, a kill right now, but that smoke's going to make it really difficult. Tabson dinked by exit, and actually Tabson trying to fall away, not just hiding in the cubby. We'll get removed in the end, so this is now a clean 2v2. Bernazan is up quite far. He's got another re-smoke for that bomb. They can just hop bomb play on it and try and cover their basis. With these defuse kits. It's going to be a tap to start off though. And that means that Crimbo will deal with exit first. Biron is a nice pick. And now he'll hold it probably. Nade though. In comes the nade break. And it didn't even need to be coming through. Safe and exit. Trying to play off of each other. Outside A. And it works out for a 2 for 2. Make that a 3 for 1 I should say. That is a lovely setup. And it's a setup that you would think should secure brawling as a duo and i really want to see more of that from mrbr as we go on toward t side as well i want to see some pace There's some pace here for mantu and actually okay well technically <laughs> technically mrbr get themselves a one for one there as crimbo says screw you mantu i'm doing this all on my own instead he gets one in mid but now they can split in toward a and that puts safe under so much pressure this is so tough for him He's being pressured up close by Sims P250. USP out. Good decision to make. So he at least gets that one. But he couldn't pull out the AWP quick enough. So two versus two. Burnsdown is getting up pretty close toward Tabson. But he's missed the timing and then walking to the left. Does he check that position? He does. And Tabson shows himself anyway. It's all down to Crimbo. And he's picked up that AWP with that Tech 9. Drop. <laughs> Making doubly sure that's a kill. Back turned. And my BR do get that third. And honestly... Speaking of, he's over towards mid. And get some space in. Needle come deep. Bounce on the corner. Breaks a smoke. Nothing spotted. Drop. Why? Oh. Bro, is going to find one. He's instantly traded by Brinson. They now they know they've lost that water control. And Brinson doubles back to find Mantu. That's a, a lovely, lovely second. So impactful. Well. Another one where Mantu can't do much. And it's all Brinson right now. He's looking superb. Safe missing his shots. But he's got his teammate holding his hand. Shouldn't be too much of an issue here for MRBR to grab a fourth. Information spotted and Sally helps out toward Crimbo. And they know that Sin is stuck. Ten seconds. T-spawn is the only option. I don't know. I feel like this is a round where you really need Mantu to at least save the orb again for the final round of this half. But at least he's managed to get an instant trade. Of course, they know that mid is completely exposed. MRBR are happy to give up mid on this round, which is another interesting ploy. One we don't usually see too much on this map. It's a different type of look. The process, of course, finding that AK means that he'll take drop as well. Hang on. Brunzan tries to peek to get another trade back in response, and it's falling apart. Mantu takes a second kill with that AWP. I mentioned he need it needs to be his round, and it is so far. Gotta be said. This is getting uh, a little janky. It might be awesome. I'm gonna come in the face as well, so we're gonna make this retake tough and exits all that's left. Oh no. How have MRBR let this round of all the rounds slip? Fair play to Big, but you've got to ask questions, MRBR. The company gets one AWP and barely upgraded pistols. And it will be an AK and a double AWP walking away from this round in their favor. Maybe the AK might not save, but the AWPs definitely Which will. seemed a little bit unaware. Oh, okay. Drop will get an opening towards Sin. Safe, though. Has to fight in the fire and flames. And because of that, it's an easy one for Tabson to take. Drop. And a few impactful rounds in this game so far. So definitely a significant step up from the first map of Vertigo. He's got double his kills already in just the first half than he had on Vertigo. Tabson waiting. See him getting pretty vocal as well. Tabson's trying to maybe beckon over Mantu to support. Idea is always sneaking forward. Ooh. We'll find one. Might not expect the second. Then he won't. Down he falls. Drop will trade. 2v3. Time ticking. Only 16 seconds. Yeah, but Drop can just play the time now. He doesn't need to throw his life away in the situation. He can just try and get some pot shot damage through that smoke. And actually, I say not. don't throw your life away. It's like it looks like he wants to try and go through that smoke. But, oh my goodness. Okay, I'd say he decides against it. But that damage through the smoke is significant. Although... 
And Sani will drop. Exit, though, should be an insurance policy. And yes, he'll catch Mantu in the side. And now Crimbo has to pull off a very difficult clutch on 11 HP. He's managed to fall away into an interesting position that I don't think the MIBR will expect necessarily. And of course, there are kits available. They can just hold that bomb. And yeah, um, Crimbo had to play that weirdly, of course, because of the cave position there. And they're going to flash their way in, and weirdly, this is exactly the same strategy that I do with my friends sometimes. Trying to split the B-bomb site with that smoke down. Process in position. He needs to do some damage there, and there's a lineup coming his oh. way. Oh, how does he get to? You thought for sure he'd get traded, <laughs> and drop can't take him down either. Trouble starts to spark it for MIBR, Brendan. Getting up close, he's heard the cross. He's going to go unchecked. Actually could potentially be able to get one and he does on towards Crimbo. I was worried with Crimbo 180. Thankfully not the case. And Mantu's up close but gives away his ruse. He will get one. He's dancing between the two. AD, AD to try and stay alive here. Coach is going to fall. Mantu still needs to step up for one more but he can't. Just drop or see him off. Oh, that's at least something to work with. They've bettered their previous map. And MIBR, I mentioned that maybe I'd like to see them go a little bit faster in these situations, but that's not really fast. That's just dry. No utility. Straight into the AWP of Mantu. Straight into the M4 of Sin. Yeah, good decision, I think, as well. Tabson's proving to... Oh, okay. That was a mistake from Tabson. I think he should understand that that smoke is very low to the ground with that step. So probably would... Relieve the pressure from IBR, giving them a free kill, but it's still a 3v2 for a big, and the bomber's force is not planted. And then Sin pounces. I guess to be so fair, he's looking to maybe peek this together, and Tabson's happy to go hunting here on 36 HP, still just pushing forward. Especially with Mantu holding that line. Does he want to hard clear the left? Well, now they know there's a player on the left, but the timing works out horribly for Tabson. He swings it because he knows where Insani is. In the end, some spray through the door. That's putting Sunny down low, but Mantu missed his shot, so it might be I will know there were three players in mid there, at least temporarily, before they took one down. Process. Ooh, lucky to get away with his life there against Brunzan. Health is kind of equal each way of it, and Sunny in the end does go for his peak in mid. He was gearing up for that for at least 40 seconds. But he'll be removed by Mantu. And now Drop has to hit an entry. He's worried about so many angles, of course, on this B bomb site. But the damage to process of Mantu now is significant. So they can get this bomb planted. They can. Bomb will go down. Like we said for MIBR. That's probably the most important thing. Keep them alive for the time being. Actually now a little bit uh, a little bit uncomfortable. Because Mantu and process are so low. Waiting for the smoke to fade. The lower players look like they're going to be cannon fodder for the retake. Time is ticking. In comes the flash. Drop gets two. It's Brunson actually helps out. There's drop second. And all that's left is Mantu. Nice. He will fall. Drop has played that to perfection. But MIBR, if they can win one cleanly here against the buy they should be expected to beat. They should be all right to make it an even 10 round game. Process burning in the open. Flash is good though. Tabson sets him up for at least one kill with the P250. Nade is good as well. Another P250 kill comes through. And Crimbo, if this Zeus somehow gets one, that would throw this round at in completely into the open. Oh my god, I'm not feeling good at all. Tabson is going to fall. Man, too trying. Got to go ahead. The yeah, miss ah. shot. Down he goes, and down goes probably big chances here. Incredibly close game, all tied square, of course. By going to be back in place for big, but there's not a lot left in this game. I think realize how dicey things could be. That Molotov's good, though. Decent damage, but more importantly, information. Sin could be the first to fall. Mantu answers back, but he could be in trouble. Dance between angles, falls through the smoke to the hands of BR and Renaissance in a matter of moments. Numbers favor might be our surely big on to let this one slip. Surely not. Ranzan will manage to at least get that, that two-piece. Even if he goes down for free now, he's done his job and he know he has. Now he can just try and be a nuisance. And he can still be that nuisance as well. Tabson and Process looking to maybe double peek into cave. Oh, this could give Bianazan one more kill, and it will as well. And it's the rifle first. Tabson's got the orp out. No. He could miss that one too. And he's gifted Bernzan four kills. No big. 
Exit. Entering into all Hieroglyphs. Decent space to speak of there as well. 5v5 as they come on towards the site. And they're going to realize very early there's not a lot of presence here. Bros' back pillar dropped. And I think, honestly, now this gets really uncomfortable. Tabson, love the swing. A lot of damage dealt. Dropping Sunny safe as well, cleaning it up. All that's left is the AK-47 of Mantu, and he's going to just try and make it expensive if he can, but he probably gets there. And he does. Goodness gracious. Shit. And that's kind of a, a middle ground map between the two as well. You never know. At least big it will be comfortable there. But MIBR continuing to get big picks. And another one from Burnzan. So impressive. A break of the smoke in mid. And Tabson gets destroyed. Lovely shot from Insani. Big falling foul of Brazilians on Anubis once again here. Man. Big are oh, just a side who really struggle on Anubis. It's not a good map for them. X, you're going to see off Sin. Tail end of this one closing out in some pretty unceremonious fashion. Oh, and a shot from safe. The float of Seth and Matt Paul, but this is the risk. This is the... Uh, where it doesn't really pay off. Mantu gets another before his demise. 13 to 10. MIBR with a second half masterclass. Indeed. So, it's a one map shootout to find out who plays Aurora later on tonight. And that is a fantastic start by Insani. Mantu had the play on him, but Insani with that P250. Seeing quite a few stars, of course, go to that P250. I think Art Frost is probably the best I've seen with it on that P250 on these T-Pistol rounds. But Insani gets a clean start with his as well. I'm looking to hold off the retake too, but that's a lovely duck headshot from Sin. Now drop is under pressure. Sin's doing so much work. Finally dealt with by Vernzan. Now 3v3. Tabson is the one with the defuse kit. Can they retake this one? It would be a fantastic start. Big have won so many important pistols in this game. It's been hard for MIBR because of that. It's an opening tap from Tabson. Not a hold of the bomb. That kit is now on the floor, thanks to safe. So is Process. And Crimbo is left last alive. Or we'll at least get one kill back in response. But he has to rush onto the site, pick up the kit, and hold the bomb immediately. And that ain't gonna happen. He's just looking for some kills. Finds one. Looking for exit. Finds... And doesn't find anything. <laughs> but still, everyone dies. But MIB on some nice skins. Drop under some pressure. MP9 is going super aggressive. Tabson, W holder. Of course, this is not the investment for big. They've just got something they can at least put forth to give them a chance in this one. Playing it safe early doors in this game, of course. And Crimbo, okay. That's not playing it safe. He's charged through that Molotov with the CZ. Tabson's found one with the Galil. Exit will remove him. But it's a two versus three. Crimbo pops his head up. Exit's removed. Got to I say fights. The first being that of Sin, who takes a lot of damage. But the MP9 of close and personal is really uncomfortable to come against. Spammer on the corner. Significantly. This uh, really does mean a lot. Sin. In this close cubby, of course, I have played there many a time and just been spammed without being able to do anything. Of course, that is paper thin. There's no spam this time. He's the one doing the spamming. He gets himself one, but not two. Insani, good trade. But Process, of course, is still here. And he's got more teammates coming in to support. Actually, it's Tabson who got taken down in the meantime there from VRN. 3v2. Process up close, though. They know he's still here. They might not be expecting him to go so aggressive. And he gets another one. Triple for Process. An exit might be heading that way. One man. 1v3. One of course, taking damage to me. He's a... What are you, uh... oh, He's a little bit vulnerable. Let's, let's not beat around the bush here. This could be so damn difficult to find. Forehead cam. Come on, exit. Yeah, you can still see as well, though. They're leaving a, a pretty deep lurking player over towards the other side. Just in goal here. Oh, right. See nothing in a matter of moments. Does not really matter. Yeah. Process. That is it. Ooh. Oh, <laughs> key. Hello. Another kill going to come through from the pistols. But a good flank on here. I think Process actually should be able to mop up the bomb. Uh -oh. oh, my God. That is so janky. This round is so janky. Bomb still not down yet. But Sin on towards the pistol. Oh, no. MRBR stole away a low buy. Be lost out. Process. Swing. Great fight. Not a good enough hole for MBR. At all, as Pro is going to make it two. Wow. And Sin comes in for support. 
Sin for a double, in fact. The Prozor actually only gets that opening one. But even still, the result's all the same. One man left alive. No real chance in hell for you Renaissance. That's rough. What a, what a way to lose it from such a small mistake. Yeah. One kill would be nice, but that's not going to happen either. Tabson's looking pretty clean individually. Oh, it's that one, of course. I'm going to pick up one of those. Nice skins. CS minus place for that. Down ramp. Dropping Sin. I'll face off in just a second. Sin, once again. This last round, this time he gets spammed in Sunny with the Hydroponic. Going to find the opener. He looks for more. Ooh. But he gets traded. Brinson will at least keep the numbers in favor. The T side. Yeah, it's a question mark whether we can, as I said, see, see a Brazilian ro roster win something. Will MRBR be a roster? They obviously won some small online tournaments and some, uh, I think, a, a very small LAN as well. But again, as we mentioned earlier, that I think that was like with Alliance and FTW, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, one of those smaller European competitions that they entered themselves in while they were in EU. So, yeah, it's uh, up to them to make the step up, but I think they've got a long way to go. Now, process needs one, can't get one. Drop will remove him unceremoniously. No chance to even shoot back. Now, Mantu, he might be in the right position, but he needs to get at least three from this position, you would think, to give Krimbo a chance at perhaps a one versus one. We'll get the first. They are still setting up utility. There's only 30 seconds. He's got a re smoke as well, Mantu. That forces him might be able to probably run through that. Rotation can come in from Crimbo. It's going to be late. But Mantu's in cave, safely in cave. Kept himself alive. At least, but with that position of Mantu, MIBR realizes he can get the bomb down safely. Do they realize Mantu's actually positioned himself there? They might just think he's back behind the site. Shadow spotted. He can see what's going on there, Mantu. Prefire will come in. Takes the kill. No trade. 2v2. And now Crimbo can come and help out. Mantu looking Ooh. for another. And they've absolutely cleaned it up. I mentioned they're going toward the wrong side if Mantu is there. Well, it was all him. Triple kill. Man, it's got to be said. What? Oh, that's a lovely pick. Insani holding the line, as he said. Did not expecting an orp, orp just to be swinging him. And Krimbo's got a secondary, don't forget, of course. He can just switch back and forth as well. So much money on this last one of the half. They've got a rifle in spawn to go back to straight away. Long start line from CT with that orp. And 50 seconds. Bomb not, net, not yet planted. We'll try and be punched in now by safe. We'll just manage it. But look at the amount of players coming his way. Good dance around to find process. But Mantu finds another. Crimbo just waiting for a sliver of one more MIBR player to cross the line. Exit and drop. To try and hold in a 2v4. They've won rougher situations in this BO3. But big. They haven't got any utility left. Only that one smoke on Crimbo. That could be impactful. But now Tabson's dropped. And they're taking quite a long time here, Big. Crimbo's going to finally get on the defuse. But Exit's going to be out of bullets. And even though Drop's got one more, it's a oh. safe defuse. It's behind the corner of the box. Sunny. Ooh, that's a disgusting tap onto a process. And a lovely start on that P2000. Double duelies as well, of course, from RBR. And that one kill from Insani perhaps has warded big away from Donut. Bomb has been planted. Wow. Viewer and made something of it. 3v2. Mantu and Crimbo has a good chance to hold this at bay because, of course, there's no defuse kit on MMBR on the CT pistol. They're fighting for their life, but there goes Crimbo, and they know exactly where Mantu is stuck. Exit just needs to distract while someone gets on the bomb, and they'll Ooh. do exactly that. Well done, Exit. MIBR will find a lifeline. Are we going to be pushing forth back to a close game again? CT Ancient is a little bit more comfortable than CT Anubis, that's for sure. Nice pick from Insani. If safe and drop, the Furia duo, of course, can put some good numbers in. We could have an even game again. Safe gets away with his kill on 1 HP. And Sunny seems to be communicating with his team. Yeah, very awkward. You can sort of see he's in the midst. 
of making a decision and coming. Because of that, almost gets caught off guard, but at least he recovers for one more kill. Good trades coming in from Big in that mid area in the end, but they needed kills without reply. Couldn't grab it. The easiest run to get to this point. This one's not too bad. Bombard will come through though, and that alone isn't actually that bad. Ah, he gets spammed on anyway. I think actually pretty well played from save, to be fair to him. Benzan gets away with not too much damage done in the end. Drop those in a tough spot. You can get pre-fired there if you're blind on the corner. But thankfully, he gets away with it and almost gets two on the spray down. That gives Benzan a freebie. But the shot on Crimbo was certainly not a freebie. That was a glorious headshot. And, that and maybe doubled away off the back of no information spotted. Drop jiggling. Shy of a minute. Might go unchecked. Will go unchecked. Approach is going to fall. Looks for more. Lines up two, but only gets the one. Sit off four. Man two trades. And drop still remains an unknown quantity. Drops now under quite a lot of pressure. Only 7 and 12 in this game. He's got a bit of a crossfire with Safe. Safe has his back, but it won't have for too much longer because that smoke is bit got up. Utility available for Big, but not a smoke for that right hand side. Safe. Continuing to watch toward long. Drop under pressure. Gets his one. Safe gets his Broken one. In towards mid. They go once again. Flash will deny a little bit of the pace. Tabson. Spot on the way through. And I think will come through towards soon. You're lucky man to stay alive. But Tabson will find the opener. Trying to take matters into his own hands now. Tabson. That's a great frag toward exit. Ooh. Safe. Oh, he hits a leg shot on Mantu. And sure, Big are going to have an after plant. But they're dropping like flies. Mantu's only 16 HP. Tabson goes down. Crimbo's only 13 HP. The health is good for MIBR. Only really drop is low. Smoke and kit available on safe. Prost is trying to play a big off angle. That could work out really well. BRN is playing so close to this smoke. It's a very hard one to take. And Crimbo is stepping up when necessary. Even one bullet from death. He is keeping big alive. Mantu finds another one, and it leaves drop last with that M4, looking to try and grab the AWP instead, but I think he's going down to the bomb here, whatever he does, he realises it, but thankfully, of course, even if they lose this round, bigger playing contact though, and safe gets absolutely obliterated by process, exit in the corner, surely he's traded, he is, 4v3 after plant. And if you're in Sunny and Drop, I would be committing to the save here. But they're going to continue to push forth. I mentioned money, money's only really good on three players. And Sunny at least finds one. Tabson continues to fake the bomb, trying to lure out another MIBR player. You can tell the nerves are building on MIBR. But Drop has found Mantu. Hang on a second. Tabson is very low. Fighting in the open. Bomb never went down during all of this. He's starting to push forward, but that's a big kill one by Crimbo. The communication now relayed over that the plant is safe. It's BRN, low HP, looking to try and win this game for his team. HE comes flying in, and it's the HE that takes it. Favor. Overtime on the cards. Let's see where we go from here. The Eagle of Insani. The messy oh. fight, but safe. We're going to find the first. Process just gets caught in no man's land, overextending a tad. Yeah, it might be art. They need to be so careful in this round, of course. And again, maybe a situation where not having that timeout that I mentioned, having used all four, could come back to bite them. Brian's in a tough position. He's just going to get pre-aimed by Sin. An angle you can't really afford to play in CS2 if you get cleared out like that. It just gives you no chance whatsoever. Still two players on B for MIBR. Safe, though. It's stuck behind the pillar. It's a very high-pressure situation. This Molotov could allow Sin to swing. Safe would be in the open. Sin takes it for free. Drop MP9. Caught on the side by Tabson. MIBR are crumbling at the business end. Exit destroyed by Mantu. Uh, I think we know what's coming. Extra rounds is the answer. Well, OT is on the cards. Insani... 24 points of HP and a deagle. No chance in hell here, unfortunately, for him. Smoke will fade. <laughs> it's a naughty shot on towards Mantu. Unfortunately, he's got no chance at anything else. He will be seen off. Overtime is wow. required here. Third map, decider. Have you really seen Art from Furia do that? Sin. Oh, flashing his way in, but looks away at the last second. And BRN and Drop go super aggressive off the back of it. And regain control of Jaguar. 
Save has the slit angle in the donut position and moves out of process. Surely this is not where Big's little streak falls immediately. Classic CS. MIBR struggle to find the win and win it in the first round of OT. Oh, a little bit of caught on the corner. No, BRN and drop. That is a huge miscommunication and mispositioning. Mantu gets a 2k spray down and Insani just goes walking into the angle. What's going on? Tabson and Crimbo 2v2. Bomb down. Crimbo's picked up the AWP. It's Crimbo versus Safe on this AWP. Safe coming forward. Big win. It's now down to Tabson. The hero of German Counter-Strike for so many years. The main man. Needs to deliver right here, right now. He's got no utility. He needs to isolate these duels one by one. Safe spotted. Safe oh. not sprayed down. Lovely yeah, angle. Here comes from it. I mean, who would be the one to take it? Safe and towards the AWP. Same for Mantu. Sunny going aggro. Successful in these positions, and he's so far up as well. Teammate support, but the flash is really good. Exit fighting through the flames. Can barely see anything. But at least he gets just trying to sell the fate that they're actually not going towards B. But that is where they want to go. 20 seconds, time's ticking, Trav. <laughs> Once again, two in a row that could be so low. That is a beautifully done spray by Burns and Crimbo removed one of the biggest factors for big. 11 seconds. There is no way to get this plant down. Burns then gets himself another one. Mantu's in the open. That is a lot cleaner. Against Spirit. Yeah, oh, Mantu. Big miss. And he refaces into safe. Uh oh. Now we're in trouble. Absolutely. That must don't favor them. Space on towards the site as well. But Thompson drops the smoke to play around it. Safe finding yet another. Oh, it's wow. a clean sweep of a T side round. There might be our deep nades coming in. Tabson trying to do what Insani did so well. Both share those roles, of course, in mid. But Insani wins another one. Lineup comes through for Crimbo. But. Bernstein will be delighted he at least gets his one. Even though he's low HP off the back of it. And two approaches remain towards B. Only one on the A site drop can do this alone. Flash will come in. Will catch him. They know he's there. Has to try and swing. We'll find Mantu. Look, Trumbull. Nice. Drop has done it. He's alone, though. And little did they know, they're actually going towards A. He's dropped. He saw the rotate, but it's Sin now all alone. A 1v3. This is going to be the toughest of tasks for him. Flash on the corner. Big box being played here by Brennazan. No way. But he's dropped in now. 1v2. It is doable. It is potential. Oh. But not anymore. MIBR 16 to 13. E aí, gostou dos melhores momentos de hoje? Não se esquece, as estatísticas estão aqui para você analisar. Pausa o vídeo caso você queira ver e acompanhar tudo certinho. Sua inscrição e seu like aqui embaixo é muito importante para a evolução do canal. Te vejo no próximo vídeo. Fui.